Hey, what's up guys? I've got a cool, quick little unboxing here uh, of the Captain America First Avenger Steelbook, the 4K um, Blu-ray and digital code version from Best Buy. This is um, a new release this week. Um, I don't think that Best Buy has released a Steelbook of this film yet. Um, they have a Steelbook of Winter Soldier and Civil War and actually pretty much all the other uh, Marvel films. And... Um, this is one I just wanted to add because I didn't own uh, this film on Steelbook. I had the the previous uh, Best Buy exclusive, exclusive version, which was a like special slip cover that I've already sold in preparation of buying this one. So anyway, let's open it up. I guess. Well, I guess I'll open it up quick because it's looking a little blurry. I don't think there's any. I think this is the exact same poster or uh, artwork that they had on most of the releases from before. Um, I think. There's this one piece of glue that it looks like, yeah. Take that off of there. Put this here. <coughs> Excuse me. And there it is. It's kind of, um... What is that, actually? Would you call that gloss? It's not glossy. It's kind of a shiny metallic. It's got a sheen to it. The, um... Well, you can see here, obviously, in the glare. It's definitely not glossy. It's not sticky or anything. It's not showing fingerprints. It's it's a matte, kind of a high gloss slash metallic look to it. And that's the back. That's the um, his original symbol or uh, shield. And that's Captain America: The First Avenger. Kind of small there with that Marvel logo. And on the side there it says um, Ultra HD Blu-ray and Marvel Studios. And then at the top it's uh, a Paramount logo. And that's Chris Evans. That's Captain America. Um, I'm I'm assuming this is me guessing that his 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 tenure as Captain uh, might be ending soon. I think he's mentioned it in the past that he wanted to kind of get out of it, but so I'm guessing he might end up dying or the carriage will die in, in game. But that's of course just me guessing. And that is a new discard actually. I think um, previously the Paramount one just was just blue, which is typical for them. And the background art is the. Um, this picture of him that I remember stock image from the movie. I actually kind of like the steelbook. At first, I wasn't so keen on it not having this, the, the name up here, but I think a lot of the Marvel steelbooks don't these days. <coughs> Excuse me. So it's not so big, such a big a deal. Actually, hold on. Here is the 4K. I still don't have a 4K player, and I know I've complained about it in the past and how I'm like, whatever, 4K, blah, blah, blah. One of these days, I'm probably going to get a 4K set up because, um, both the TVs I use are over, wait, around 10 years old. One of them for sure is over 10 years. The other one is a plasma screen that is, um, I think it's about eight, nine years old, I think. Plasma tends to last longer, but it's already got some burn in that I'm not too keen on. So at some point in the future, potentially near future, I'm going to end up getting a 4K setup like I said I was never going to do. but. Whatever. I guess I never looked at the special features here. This is the J card. But like I said, this is not a new release. It's the same movie, just releasing on 4K for the first time. There's the 4K information and the same features as before. Um, <coughs> it has a, war, a Marvel one shot when they used to do those. Uh, the fun thing happened to Widow Thor's Hammer. Assembly begins, six featurettes, deleted scenes, and commentary. Usual stuff. This is a, it's a region ABC, and of course 4Ks are region free as well, so that's pretty cool. Um, iTunes version requires an iTunes account, which is pretty typical, I suppose. <laughs> so yeah, that's it. Easy peasy. I'm looking forward to checking this out. I have not watched this film in actually kind of several years. Um, I remember when I first watched it, I was not a huge fan of it. It's just uh, I was never a huge fan of. Um, um, Captain America, so I don't know. But I'm definitely looking to check it out. Um, and like I said, it's been a while, so I'll check it out in the future. And I also would assume these aren't going to fly off the shelf, because it's not a it's not a brand new release, but at the same time, I don't know what their stock is like at Best Buy. So if you're wanting to get this, I would pick it up um, obviously today. You know, I'm, I'm going to probably upload this on Tuesday, so they're out today. And uh, just go check them out. So That's it, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll have more <coughs> excuse me. God damn it steelbooks and whatnot in the future so stick around if you want to check those out 
Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again later. Uh, peace.